Hey friends, how are you? Happy Monday. We are back. It's always a Monday. I love it. Um, We are back with a brand new style I'm here to talk to you about. First of all, my name is Katie. This is Capturing Fashion with Katie from Lululemon Boutique. And I'm here to talk to you today about the fit and the style of the Rebecca. This is our cross front blouse. There we go. I have the cheat sheet. Okay. This is our cross front, front blouse. And I'm super excited to tell you all about her. First, one little piece of business that I want to address. Um, I was talking to a friend recently, um, at our event a couple weeks ago and she was like, yeah, I do the fit videos on YouTube too. And I was like, yeah, and she's like, you know, like three minutes and I'm out. And I'm like, three minutes? Like mine are anywhere from like 10 to 20. And she's like, what? Stop it. Stop it. Don't ever do that again. And I'm like, really? Cause really? <laughs> so uh, my question for you is this, this one might be a little bit longer, but do my endless yammerings drive you crazy and you leave if you're brand new? Um, would you leave if you are one of my peoples? Um, do you wish I would shut the hell up and get to the point? Do Would you like these videos to be shorter? Um, or are you good with about the 10 minutes or plus mark that I usually give you? I try and give you all the details and try on all the different things. Anyways, let me know in the comments. Now that that's done, let's talk about the Rebecca. So again, our cross front blouse. I'm going to also try to not repeat myself so many times because that's what I do a lot. She is long sleeve. She is brushed DTY, which means legging material, guys. I know when I post about it, at least in the group, and I say, you know, it's this and it's like the fancy material name. Nobody ever knows what that means. Brush DTY basically means legging material. So I know that you're going to love that. Second of all, I love that we've got a little bit of booby action happening right here. Now don't run away. You obviously can wear a cami, and I'm going to show it to you with a cami as well. Um, but I wanted to start it without the cami. Um, I'll also show you how stretchy this is once I have the cami on. But um, it, we have that full cross uh, front. So it does connect right here. And then this side is on the same side, but on the inside right here. So you got the full cross. You can kind of adjust it how you want it to be for you. Um, my, I have a lot going on upstairs. So that, um, plays a part. Uh, there's things that might not be very boobalicious on you that are on me just because I have so much going on just so it just kind of depends on your body shape, but you can adjust it. So see, I kind of pulled that front, uh, this, this inside one up a little bit and then that way and down and now now it's not so boobalicious right or you could pull it down so it's like that or you could pull it even more but frankly we're getting a little bit scandalous as it is so there we go I don't think that's good enough there um but I love her nice long sleeve again legging material so it's super super comfy and we have the band across the bottom uh, it's still nice and relaxed fit it's not too form-fitting but it's also not uh too flowy this is a really lovely blouse like super great for like a date night or date with the girls or even the office maybe with the cami so this Rebecca super super cute I am wearing a large right now that is my true size size chart for this one says an 810 for a medium 12 14 for a large uh that means a 16 18 for an extra large do the math up and down it's two per size you get where I'm going with this now the reason I always tell you those sizes is because I am about a 14 and sometimes our size chart says an 810 for a medium and sometimes it says a 10 12 for a medium um, when it says a 810 for a medium, I'm usually, um, a large because then we're 12, 14 for the larges, right? And I'm about a 14. Now, um, when it's a 10, 12 for a medium, then a lot of times I like the medium because I was a nice solid 12 before the cookies. So now I'm a 14. I'm working back to the 12. Um, but even so, I think in this blouse, I would really just stick with true to size, which is going to be this large, which is what I'm wearing. I am going to try on a medium for you today, though. It is a very stretchy style with being legging material, so I'm sure I can get in to the medium, and I'm going to try an extra large on for you as well. I don't really see any purpose to try on or even to get yourself anything smaller or bigger than that. We're going to see. I mean, I'm thinking true to size is probably going to be perfect, but we always have to test the waters, right? So um, again, this is the large, which is my true size, my size chart size. And I'm loving it. It's super duper cute. But again, let's try an extra large. I'm going to put on a cami and the extra large and we'll try on a medium as well. All right. So this is an extra large and actually this one isn't too bad either. Now we have a lot more room through here. So you can see it's going to be a lot more revealing if I didn't have the cami underneath it. But with the cami, uh, I love it even 
with this size up. So I did a nice contrasting color for the cami. Obviously, you could wear black. It would also be pretty cute if you want a higher neckline to go with our Hope bodysuit to go under this. If you want even more coverage, uh, then that one would work as well, too. I like just your simple cami. You can even pull it down a little bit more if you want a little bit more ba ba boom or up if you want, like I said, a little bit more coverage. Uh, I have, I know a lot of people that have just been wearing these around and though they don't come open, you don't really have to worry about that. It just stays. It's the magic of LuLaRoe. But if say, oh my goodness, like I wish I had this when I was um, a nursing mom to Kenzie because it's so simple just to move it um, completely. So it also gives you some more like style options. Like I don't mind this at all. Just and it gives me a little bit more flowiness down here in the tummy area if I wanted to cover that up um, or and then expose more of the cami underneath whatever I'm layering it with, especially if maybe you did like a printed cami underneath a solid or like I'm doing with the contrasting colors, then you can kind of wear it like that. So you can show some more or again, pull it up uh, because I have that cami there to hold it. It definitely is easier to before I had sil slip it on my silky bra. It didn't want to stay very well. Now with the cami underneath, you can definitely pull it a little bit more if you want more coverage with this top. So this extra large is actually not too bad. I was thinking that true to size would just be it for me, but this, this isn't too shabby. So, um, we should probably try on a medium. I'm actually going to take the cami off cause I feel like the medium, it's a toss up whether or not it's going to provide me more coverage or less. I guess we're about to find out. All right. So medium next. All right, definitely got a little bit more va va boom in this one. This one is um, a medium. I actually don't hate it, but again, I quite frequently wear um, larges or mediums in our styles, so the medium is not too bad. It does give me a little bit more um, wow factor through this area, so I think I would definitely wear this depending on what I'm doing that day. Maybe if I'm wearing it for a date night, I think my husband would appreciate the medium. If I'm wearing it out with the girls, um, then the large is perfect, and then if I want want to get a little bit stylized, then the extra large is pretty nice. But overall, I think that if you're trying to choose, going with your true size is going to be your best overall bet. Um, I definitely can kind of play with this a little bit, so it's not quite so crazy. Um, don't forget that a lot of things look a little bit um, more boobalicious on me. If I, I know I've already said it, but I just want you to know. They look a little bit more boobalicious on me than necessarily than on any, on more on me than on others because I have a lot going on up here for sure. I'm also wearing a nice push-up bra to give me that nice effect here. So there is that as well. But this super cute top, wear it so many places. I can't wait. It's super cute with denim. I can't wait to tuck it into some Diane pants or with a skirt. Lots of possibilities to dress the style up and I cannot wait to show them to you tonight. So um, if you are not already, come find me on Facebook, Capturing Fashion with Katie. Um, we're over there. My link is in the bio as well. You can shop my website, go directly there and get yours or you can come and find me on Facebook. Send me a message if you need any help um, and I will see you guys later. Super stoked to have to go play dress up and try on all of the rubbish. Becca's.